Um, we've been on a tour of Central Library this morning. Um, we've just been going around and seeing all the work that's being done. Um, we've seen walls half ripped down. We saw remnants of the old library still in place there. Um, well, we got started from the Town Hall extension and um, that's going to be one of the alternative entrances. Um, we've got to see the inside of the Town Hall and all the old carpets and it looks like a sort of haunting house. And then uh, got taken to the very basement of the library and shown all the old reading areas. Fantastic day today, a building that I really, really, really love, the Central Reference Library. We it was really interesting. I've seen places I never knew existed in the library and they were being torn apart and there was lots of old decor and stuff that's being preserved which was quite interesting. Um, the council chamber, chamber was good to go in, I've never seen anything like that before and there was good memorials on the walls. And some of the things that really stuck out for me were that um, the central reference library used to be that you could only access 30% of the building and the rest of it was all um, wasn't open to the public and they're going to flip that and so they're transforming it so that 70% of that building is going to be open to the public um, and the rest will be office space. And the thing that I'm really, really, really excited about that I didn't know until I was in there today, you can see where they're ripping out holes um, to put in two massive stairwells, um, big glass stairwells, so you'll be able to walk right the way from the bottom all the way to the top and it just means you'll be able to see all the beautiful architecture and design features that are in there that were kind of hidden away with all the partitions that have been put up over the years. It's going to be great for formal space, cafe area and this, they're going to do this. It's going to be really good. I think it will be really nice to sort of see the place taking shape. I'd be quite interested in doing a bit of a sound project there really and sort of collecting the sounds that are going on while the renovation is taking place. I think it would make a really interesting soundscape kind of piece. As I was looking at more at the location, I thought some of the building sites would, would be good to film in just as locations for something. I don't know if we can get access to that, but um, some of it make great locations for like a pop video or a horror video or something like that. There are so many angles here. I'm quite interested in the engineering and the performance and the computing and the public space. I think just like the surroundings really. Um would be really would look really good in, if you were going to do interviews with people who've been there and worked there in the past. I think it'd be quite poignant, quite sad as well in some respects, but but exciting as well. So I'm really, really excited to see the transformation as it happens and to be given the opportunity to go in and film some of that, talk to some of the people that are involved is, is really, really exciting. I think, I think they're being really kind of open to allowing people to see the process taking place and I think that's really nice actually that, you know, it's, it's not this huge mystery that we can actually see it taking shape. Well, if you're interested in your community and interested in Manchester, then yeah, I suppose so, because it's an important building, obviously, which is why they're doing it all up. Yeah, it's really exciting to go behind the scenes and see what other people haven't seen before. Great fun. Looking forward to the next year. Going to learn a lot. Going to see this great two this new building be transformed by the people and skills a Manchester folk. We come along and see what's going on because if you've got an interest in heritage or engineering or crafts or anything like that, I think this will be fascinating to you. Or even like a Manchester citizen to see something of what's in your history taking shape. You won't get a chance like that again because it'll be a new building in the future and that won't get ripped out for another 50, 60 years, whatever it is. So, um, yeah, definitely come down and have a look. It's good. It's a good day out. Yeah. It's a huge job and big respect to them for doing it. If you're interested in people, you should be here. What are you doing? Get here.